you know, it's not, you don't want to try to <laughs> convince a girl that she's falling for a horrible guy. Because if you, if you try to do something like that, you're essentially trying to, you're going to try to, you're going to give her the impression that you're trying to sabotage whatever she might be having with this guy or whatever experience she's having with this guy. And you'd be coming off as, as a sabotager, you know, and in essence, she might actually askew you. She might actually throw you to the curb, all right, so that you don't even have any say in her world anymore. So it's not your job to try to convince this girl that she's falling for a horrible guy. That's not your job, okay? Even though it sounds like more than likely you like this girl, you don't want to get into something like that. You don't want to get into something like that. What you want to do is just essentially try your best, you know, to live your life and live it as independently and as well as you can, you know? Try to start making new friends. Try to start forming a new circle of friends around you, all right? And let her be. Let her be because the more you try to convince her that it's a horrible guy, what you're in essence doing is you're actually pushing her further towards that guy. Because human nature is such that when someone is telling you you shouldn't be doing something, a lot of times that's when you would do it. You know, when someone tells you you can't have that person, all of a sudden that's the person you want, right? We tend to want what we don't have. So you might actually be if you go this route trying to convince her that she's falling for a horrible guy, you might actually be doing the opposite of what you're trying to do. So the point here is to leave her be, separate yourself from the situation, go live your life, you know. Doesn't mean that you two are not friends, you know, if, if she communicates with you, no problem. But don't talk about it. Don't talk about this horrible guy. Just talk about other stuff. Live your life, enjoy your new friends or whoever friends you have, be social, do what you gotta do, live an active life. Don't get caught up in what she's doing. Don't get caught up in her business because guess what? That's her business. Okay? And what will more than likely happen is if your instincts are right about this guy, guess what? She's going to have to experience that. And when she experiences the negativity of what happens by falling for this guy, she's going to learn, right? She's going to learn. So it's not your place to try to convince her because, like I said, you could do the exact opposite and actually push her more towards him, okay?